So this is a term that's pretty common and, and most of you may already know, but pillars. On a vehicle, there's what's called pillars. So you have the roof of the vehicle, okay? So you have the roof up here and it's supported by these pillars, you know? So like pillars on a building or whatever. And uh, so right here in the very front, um, this is the what I'm talking about, these right here. So on the windshield, you have the two pillars in the front. Okay, now, not everybody considers these a blind spot, but they actually are a blind spot. Uh, they are typically, um, almost every vehicle, they are wide enough to where you can, at a certain distance, their vehicle, another vehicle far away, can be hidden behind those. Especially if you're moving and they're moving, they can that movement can line up in which they stay behind that pillar the entire time until all of a sudden bam you know there's this car there like where'd that come from um so the 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 pillars here on the front i just want to mention that when that's why you have to come to a complete stop at a stop sign but that way if you're moving if you come to a complete stop it's easier to for you to locate moving objects Okay, but if you're moving and they're moving, then they you know, kind of causes an issue as far as, you know, finding your eyes locating moving objects and making sure you don't see it. So if you've ever had that experience in which all of a sudden there's this car there and you didn't see it the whole time, it's probably because it was behind some kind of blind spot in which you were moving and they were moving and it stayed behind the whole time. Anyways, okay, so this one in the front is called the A pillar. The second one is called the B pillar and so on. So you have a D pillar. Okay, so you so that's how it starts. So here on the front is A, B, C, D, or whatever. How many pillars the vehicle has? You know, it could be the you know long SUV or whatever. Um, so when somebody says a C pillar or a D, or a, a B pillar, you know what I'm talking. You'll know what they're talking about now. See, in this particular car, you'll see it has an A pillar in the windshield. Then it has this B, and then the C pillar is actually a really wide blind spot. Um, much wider than you'll find in a lot of other cars so this one has a uh, you know issue there as far as the blind spot um, but anyways that's the pillars that's what they are and then that's how to locate the one that they're talking about a b and c so a lot of people will say a pillar for any any pillar in the vehicle but it's actually you know they're they're specific uh, letters depending on where they're located in the vehicle so hopefully this has been helpful